Hello dear aspirants welcome back to college review series by Akash Today we are going to review one of the oldest NITs yes Malvia National Institute of Technology Jaipur or also known as MNIT Jaipur So in this video we'll find out everything about this wonderful NIT its placements cut off fee structure courses and many more And if you want to know if this NIT is a best fit for you then do watch this video till the end MNIT Jaipur has a rich heritage of 60 years of producing world class engineers managers architects and scientists it is a tier 1 nit and has been ranked 37th in the nirf 2023 the institute offers various learning opportunities to its undergraduate postgraduate and researchers in various domains mnit jaipur awards its students in bachelor of engineering programs in courses such as chemical engineering civil engineering computer science and engineering electrical engineering electronics and communication engineering mechanical engineering and metallurgical and materials engineering now let me show you the extent of mnit jaipur cut off 2023 in various branches first of all students you must know that there are total 811 seats reserved for engineering students half of the seats that is 50% of the seats are reserved for home state candidates that means the candidates who are the residents of rajasthan and the remaining 50% seats are offered to other states candidates or let's say the students from all over india except rajasthan let's have a look at the branch wise cut off for general category and yes if you want category wise cut off for different branches then do visit the official website of josa counseling the link is given in the description for students interested in the chemical engineering branch the opening rank for home state aspirants was 8511 and the rank closed at 30836 For other states it started at 22184 and closed at 26958 so whether you are a home state or an other state candidates if you manage to secure a rank somewhere around 20000 you can make it to chemical engineering at MNIT Jaipur now for computer science and engineering branch the rank cut off goes considerably higher For home state candidates the required rank should be between 2323 and 5746 and for the other states the rank requirement is between 2684 and 4909 therefore you will have to secure rank around 3000 in order to get computer science branch now for the electrical engineering branch the required rank was between 9 to 15000 for home state candidates and was between 7 to 15000 for other state candidates hence if you keep a target of securing approximate rank around 13 to 14000 then you can easily get yourself there coming on to electronics and communication now for home state candidates the rank opened at 6566 and closed at 10112 and for other states it started at 6828 and stopped at 10168 therefore you must aim to secure a rank between 8 to 9000 in order to be on the safer side Likewise you can check MNIT Jaipur cut off for all the remaining branches you can pause the video or take a screenshot to check the rank requirement for all the other branches now let me show you the wonderful placement data at MNIT Jaipur according to the final placement report 2022-23 657 undergraduate and 274 postgraduate students were placed during MNIT placements 2023 the overall placement percentage for undergraduate courses stood 81% and 66% for postgraduate courses let's have a look at the undergraduate placement statistics 
It is the branch-wise average, median and highest package offered in the 2023 placement drive. The surprising figures show that the highest package was drawn from the Electronics and Communication Engineering branch, which was of 64 LPA. The median package was 15 lakh per annum and the average package here was 17.19 LPA. Now, the second highest package came from Electrical Engineering branch that was 62.75 LPA. And the third highest package came from the Computer Science branch which was 57.75 LPA. Now, the best thing about this branch was its average package that stood at 20.96 LPA, which actually matters when we study the placement record of an institute. Overall, the average package stood at 13.20 LPA, median package stood at 11 LPA, and as we have discussed before, the highest package stood at 64 LPA, which was from the Electronics and Communication branch. Every year, 250 companies and recruiters visit the MNIT Jaipur campus. Here is a list of prominent companies that visit MNIT Jaipur. Now let's have a quick tour of the most talked about campus. Yes, MNIT Jaipur has a decent campus of 317 acres, which is located in one of the prime locations of Jaipur. The institute's campus includes all the essential amenities for community living such as hospital, post office, library, community centre, school, gymnasium, playing fields, guest houses and cafeterias. Now, it's time to find out what do you need to do in order to get in here. Eligibility and admission process. Yes, all you need to do is to qualify joint entrance exam that is JEE main and pass class 12th board examination with science stream. If you are a general category student, then 75% is the required percentage and 65 for SC, ST or PWD category. Further, if you fulfill the required percentage and the rank requirement, you need to register yourself for JOSA counselling or CSAP special round. Whereas, if you are a foreign student, then you will be accepted through DASA, Direct Admission of Student Abroad. Now, the next important thing that you need to know is the fee structure. The total fee for the entire four years BTEC program inclusive of tuition fee, institute fee, one-time admission charges and group insurance charges will amount to be 7 lakh rupees. Whereas, if you want to avail hostel and mess facilities, then you will be charged 3 lakhs extra for that. Now, here is the detailed fee structure for the students going to be admitted in the year 2023-24. In addition, MNIT Jaipur also offers certain scholarships to its meritorious and economically weaker section candidates. For detailed information on MNIT Jaipur scholarships, do visit the scholarship portal on the official website of MNIT Jaipur. MNIT Jaipur which is known for its impeccable teaching, infrastructure, state-of-art laboratories and providing lifelong experiences, also expects something in return. As the college is very strict with regards to its attendance policy. Yes, 75% attendance is must. So if you are thinking of having some good fun time during these four years of your college life, then prepare yourself for certain tough days as well. Moreover, if you manage to secure good CGPA during these years of yours, then the institute will definitely offer you certain great internship and placement opportunities. So the call is yours. This was all from me today. Do let me know which institute you want me to review next. And yes, don't forget to like and subscribe so that you do not miss any of the updates. Take care.